What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu walkthrough. Okay, so, off screen, I did a lot, and I mean a lot of grinding, meaning I've been catching a crap ton of uh, chances right here. And because of that, I actually got my Pokemon up to mo the majority of my teams up to level 80. As you can see, Sparky's at level 88, Dragonite's at level 80, Sandslash 83. Uh, Godzilla, Smasher, and Leonardo all at level 80. While I got these other Pokemon right here, hold on just a sec, let's see, Pokemon box. I got these other Pokemon right here, such as Mew de Uno at level 80, uh, Thrasher's at level 76, Hydra's at level 77, uh, and Ultra Psycho at level 80. So, there has been a lot of stuff that I've done off screen just to get these guys to where they need to be. And I, I did mention a few episodes ago that it took five Pokemon to actually unlock a special event. I was wrong. It's actually six. I don't know if I'm going to get all six of them right here in this episode, but I'm going to try and get the majority of them. That way, off screen, I can actually battle the main guy to this whole thing right here. So, what we're going to do is I'm actually going to use the hell oh he's he's mad oh damn my bad all right let's let's uh, let's give him a, a little cuddle right here so in this episode right here i'm going to attempt to battle uh at least six trainers hopefully you know it goes well off screen i attempted to battle some and yeah it, it just it, it just didn't work out so a lot of these master trainers play to their strengths of their pokemon meaning if their stats are per, like if a stat hits one particular uh, particular part, such as special or physical, they're gonna make that Pokemon that kind of Pokemon, the version of like a special attacker or a uh, defensive Pokemon. Now, a lot of these moves that you've been ignoring, such as like Calm Mind, you know, uh, stat boosters and all that stuff, they're gonna come into a, uh, into effect here too because holy crap. They're gonna be, it's gonna be like, holy shit, they, this, so this is what it's for, but it's for competitive play and all that stuff. So, our first attempt will be against a Sand Slash, so, yeah, a, f a few episodes ago too, I have also said, is it possible to actually use uh, an Alolan Sand Slash against a regular Sand Slash, and the answer is yes, because I've attempted it, it worked well. So now, we're just going to be battling the Sand Slash trainer right here, and hopefully everything goes well right here. So let's go ahead and see. I am the Sand Slash Master. My only desire is to find the ultimate Sand Slash. Hmm, your Sand Slash seems to be very strong. Why not have it face off against my Sand Slash? So, alrighty, so here we go. Our first battle against the Sand Slash Master, which is Hiker Benjamin right here. And this guy right here is going to be coming out with his very own Sand Slash, regular. It is, it is going to be a ground type, so just be aware that it, ground types are stronger against steel type Pokemon. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go with the Blizzard and... Good gravy! Oh, man. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of right there, that, you know, it wasn't going to work out like that. So I pretty much lost right here. Holy crap. Because Blizzard decided to screw me over. Okay. So, that was a failed attempt right there. Now, keep in mind, your Pokemon do not faint. Uh, well, they faint, but they're not fainted for very, very long. They're going to be still in their same original form and all that stuff. So, you guys can battle these guys as many times as you want if you fail. Uh, mind you that you can't use any healing items there's no experience points and you don't earn any of the money here too so just be aware of that so let's go ahead and try this again and hopefully the the whole uh, blizzard right here will actually work oh my god you gotta be kidding me you've got to be kidding me so here we go sand slash master hiker benjamin again going with his sand slash and i'm gonna go straight for my sand slash Let's get this. Come on, Blizzard. Don't fail me now. And there we go. Blizzard takes a good chunk out of its uh, HP right there. And here he comes with a substitute. And, well, let's go right ahead and have him, have him waste a turn right here. So we're going to dig right now. And this guy's going for a drill run. So let's go ahead and hit this guy or hit his substitute and hopefully make this substitute faint right here. And here it comes, it's 
Good God. Okay, it's drill run right here. Good gravy. <laughs> wow. A critical hit. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, we're... Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be a long night if we're going to be trying to do this. And uh, to be quite honest, I do not want to train my Pokemon any further uh, with capturing a bunch of sans, uh, uh, san uh, chances in the in the Cerulean cave. But if it has to be that way, good gravy. I have to keep up with my strategy and all that stuff. So, again, let's go with a blizzard. Come on, good gravy. Ah, uh, let's go, blizzard. Come on. This should probably kill this uh, this substitute right here and. No, this substitute is... Okay, it's still there. And this guy using a drill run. Jeez. Okay, so... So that's 0-3 right there. Good gravy. Good gravy. Oh, balls! Okay, so that's 3. Oh, my God. This guy... This guy's really, really... Uh, this guy's really pissing me off. Okay, let's go. Let's go. To, let's do this again. Again, we're not losing any money right here. <sighs> it looks like we're not going to get six done. It really doesn't feel like it. So here we go. Going up against uh, this guy right here. And, well, one thing's for sure. Blizzard is very unreliable. So here we go. Blizzard attack. And that does it. And... Here comes a drill run, and if this becomes a critical hit, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> okay. Alrighty, so let's get the finishing touch right here. Come on! And there we go. This Sand Slash has been defeated. So after three attempts, we got our first victory against uh, Sand Slash Master. Wow. Holy crap. Okay. Yeah, okay. So we are now a Sand Slash Master right here, and well... Now it is time for us to go to the next one right here, and from what it's looking like, I'm going to go for the easy one right here. I'm going to go for the Pikachu, because my Pikachu is at level 88, so it shouldn't have no issue. And it uh, seems like unpleasant happened to Sparky. It's in a bad mood. Okay. Let's go right ahead and go back to Viril uh, Vermi Viridian City, I should say. Good God. You see, you see what I mean, guys? It's, it's a tough long road against these guys right here so here we are flying back and sparky you're about to kick some ass right here since you're at level 88 now let's see there's a pidgey where are you where are you you should be here somewhere not there now, if I don't get these six people by tonight, then eventually, you know, I'm going to be training up my Pokemon just to get to, uh, well, yeah, just, just to get to six uh, eventually. Uh, but I'm probably not going to showcase it right here. So, let's see. Where are you, Pikachu Master? Let's see. Not right there. That's a lot of bugs. I'm going to, I'm going to be checking every corridor for this, this person right here because... From what I remember, the last person told me that there's a Pikachu Master right around here somewhere. So we've already encountered a, a Weedle Master. And is that guy shiny? No, it's not shiny. I wish. Okay. Uh, let's see. Anything I want to talk about before this happens? Well, yeah. Uh, I was watching Austin John plays and... I got a lot of strategy. Uh, I got a, a lot of strategy covered from that, the videos that he came out uh, in regards to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. And it, trust me, guys, it's a lot of candy training. It is a lot of. Uh, it's just a lot of capturing and all that crud. And for me, it's like it, it's 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 too it's too much it's too much time that I I can use for other walkthroughs right here. So. Uh, if I don't complete something, then I, I do, excuse me, I, like, I, I'm sorry, it's just that, you know, I kind of have to, you know, get on with my life with the whole, uh, Pokemon right here, and here is the Pikachu Master. Alright. <sighs> Undefeated streak on the line right here, because Pikachu has yet to, uh, this Pikachu has yet to lose, so here we go, level 88 Pikachu, let's go. 
I'm a Pikachu master, of course, they're going to be saying the same thing, so I'm just going to be pressing this A button right here, and we're going to go. Alrighty, now, remember, my Pikachu has perfect stats right here, so it does have an advantage in both level and stats. And this person right here has a female Pikachu, so let's go, Sparky, let's get this. This Pikachu is at level 75, and, well, let's go for the dig right here. Okay, hopefully this will actually take care of this guy. And as you can see, it is using Reflect, so now that dig is not going to be super effective. Well, it's not going to be as effective as it was. And look at that. Physical attack, whatever. And good gravy! There's a toxic attack right there. Yeah, so we're really going to have to just like... We're really going to have to grind onto this kid right here. And let's see... Alrighty, so let's go right ahead and use another dig. There was another move that I learned here. Now, I gotta beat this guy quickly, and there is a substitute, and of course, Toxic is kicking our butts right here. Okay, so that was super effective, and uh, let's see, come on. The Faded, and what are you gonna do? Nope, Slam has uh, affected that, and I'm still getting fucking poisoned right here. Now, remember, every turn we use... Every turn that we uh, we move, it, it's just gonna it's just gonna uh, keep on getting worse and worse. So we have to beat this guy quickly. And well, it looks like they it looks like it's gonna beat itself because of course the reflect has worn off. Pikachu uh, on the other side right here has used its uh, substitute again. And well, it's look at that. Okay, so slam. We moved, and we are still getting poisoned pretty badly. So. We got one more turn right here, and it can't use it can't use substitute right now. And crap baskets! I just oh, I messed up. And they're undefeated no more. God dang it! <sighs> yeah. All right, let's do this again. Alrighty. Okay. We're going to do this. We're going to do this right. Unfortunately, Dig is the only move that can actually learn. It's pretty good right here. So let's just go right ahead and just wreck this person right now. And, of course, we're probably going to be uh, getting hit by uh, uh, quite a few uh, substitutes right here. So the goal is to try and hit it as many times as possible before we faint. This guy is going for Reflect. And here comes the Dig attack. Not going to be a... Uh, not going to be a critical hit, I know that for a fact, and look at that. You're, oh yeah, so we we survived right there for the toxic attack. Don't know if this guy's going to go for another, um, he's going to go for a substitute right here. And look at that, so things are going our way right here. And there we go, that's how you do it! Whoo, okay. Well, we got that W. But we're undefeated no more with Pikachu. So that kind of just pisses me off right there. So that right there is number two for us. And... Ah, oh, gravy. Ah, oh, gravy. Pikachu is not happy, I could tell. Look at that. Making a solid... Oh, look at that. Okay, so we're just going to pet you. Somebody had to beat us. Somebody had to beat us, and it had to be a Pokemon, uh, Pikachu Master. So, as you can see, these guys are very, very, very strategic. And, uh, yeah, it's it's going to be... It is going to be a you-know-what to actually take these guys on. So, we're going to try another Master Trainer right here and see, and hopefully we can beat them. I, I am not testing my luck with the rest of them. So, the next Master Trainer I kind of want to use... Or go up against this Charizard. And we actually have to go to Route 23. Now this Charizard right here is at level 75. So what we're going to have to do is... Uh, well, we already we already got everything taken care of. So let's go ahead and take a look at our, our uh, map right here. Hold on. Again, I'm thinking that I'm seeing shinies here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Come on. Town map, Route 23. Route 23 should be right here. Oh, so it's in the Pokemon League. Okay, so... Alright, all the way back. 
Pikachu is uh, in a bad mood right now. He is not happy. Jeez, I'm not. In, I'm not even happy at all because we have to go through these master trainers to un to unlock something like this. And I I'm sorry if I'm sounding very negative, guys, but this is just like you know I'm not used to this whole you know r like I'm not used to this whole thing right here where we have to actually take on like to use the strat uh, strategy now. I'm pretty sure that a lot of us have not used like moves like reflect or protect or anything like that in order to win a battle. Now, if you guys are competitive players, well, pff, wow, more respect to you guys for actually, you know, for actually being masters at that. Because for me, I'm not a competitive player. I'm just, you know, a walkthrough artist right here. I don't like doing, uh, I don't like doing any kind of a competitive plays because it's just like, you know. I'm not fully educated on the whole Pokemon uh, game thing, like what items work on what combinations and all that stuff. And, you know, that's just me right there. I don't have the time to actually do it. And, wow. Look at that. We found ourselves three golden raspberries. Wow. That's, that's funny. Should have seen that coming. And, well, we're at Route 23 looking for this guy right here. He should be here somewhere. You will be able to find a few uh, a few master trainers around this area too. And how did we not see those items? Huh. Okay, so I guess we got an item up there. And going right here. And I see a Dratini master. And here we have three pinat berries. So now. Yeah, we're gonna, we're just gonna have to we're just gonna have to acclimate. If I can't beat the rest of the, if I can't get all six masters here, then you know what? I can you know I can do it off screen, train a little bit more, and uh, be on my way right there. So there's Dratini, and well, let's see, he should be here somewhere. Nope, that's Needle Queen. Huh. Okay, so we got Needle Queen on the team. Might as well try her. Let's see. Needle Queen is with us. Okay, so let's go ahead and try Needle Queen before we battle uh, the next one, just to get a feel from her and all that stuff. Now, I was gonna use Needle King, but yeah, the guy's at level 80. My Needle King's not at level 80, so we're just gonna have to just play how it is and all that stuff. So here comes Percy with his very own Needle Queen. Let's go, Smasher. Hopefully uh, this actually works out or something. So level 75 versus level 80 right here. We got some pretty good moves. Let's go for a drill run. Hopefully we're faster. Yes, we are. So here we go. That actually takes a good move. And Blizzard. Yes. Holy crud. Okay. So we gotta we gotta go quickly with this one right here. So let's go drill run. Okay, so this would actually work if... Yes, Blizzard didn't work! <laughs> okay, let's do this! Let's go, Nino Queen! And that makes three. Oh my god. Okay, so that worked. The strength is a real thing. Okay, so we are now a Nino Queen Master. That was something very unexpected right there. Alright, let's go ahead and save that. That way, if I, you know, I screw up, I can just redo this again and all that stuff. So, uh, let's see. We got quite a few Pokemon that, right here that we can actually capture, too. But, actually, there there probably are Pokemon in here that, you know, that we still haven't gotten. Or we, we still have gotten. It's just that, you know, didn't know that they were in this location and all that stuff. Let's see. Charizard should be here somewhere. He should be here. That's Nido King. Good gravy. That guy, I am not going after. He has Surf, he has, uh, and it's at level 80, so I don't think I'm going to fare well, fare too well on this. Where the hell are you? Okay, so hold on. Hold on, let me check my map here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Where is you? Alrighty, Master Trainers, you suck. Charizard, you are at level... Oh, okay. Never mind. I know where you're at. Lightly hit you. Want some attention. Okay, let me give you some attention, buddy. Right here. Right here. And you know what? Just to get you off my case, 
Sorry that I'm saying it that way, but we gotta, we gotta, we gotta win, guy. Alrighty, so that is that. And now that Pikachu is a little happy, let's go right ahead and go straight up to the Pokemon League. Because technically speaking, this is still Route 23. So let's go straight to the Pokemon League right here. And, well, look at that. We're flying, and all we got to do now is just fly down here. He should be here somewhere. Let's see. There he is. Okay, so... We got three. We're just trying this out right here, guys. I did the same exact thing this guy did, and that is give uh, my Charizard a Thunder Punch. So hopefully this will actually work. I am a Charizard Master. Let's go right ahead and do this. Alrighty. I don't think you can use your your Mega Mega Evolutionary Stone right here. I don't know. Alrighty. So here we go. Charizard against Charizard. And there might be a good reason why it has uh, a Dragon-type move. Okay. Let's go with the Y version right here. And... I'm only assuming this guy is a Dragon-type trainer. So let's go right ahead and go with Flying and Dragon-type right here. And this guy, of course, will use Protect. So that's a downside right there. And, okay, so we're a little, f we're a little faster. So I was kind of thinking that this guy had a... Uh, yeah, I was thinking that this guy had a, whatchamacallit, uh, what was it, a Mega Stone, and so, here we go, we're gonna go with the Thunder Punches right here, this guy, what the hell? Oh my god, that is not fair, okay. Oh jeez, so we're gonna probably lose this one right here. Okay, so, I picked the wrong Mega, mega Evolution right there, so... All right, let's go right ahead and try this again. All right, so if we turn into the dragon, then of course we won't be as affected as we once were. We just made the mistake of going to Y right here, because I was kind of thinking this guy was going to do a Mega Evolution. I always get the whole X and Y uh, Charizards mixed up with like their dragon typing, because one of them actually is a dragon type. So let's see, let's go with the Y Evolutionary, and let's go with Thunder uh, Thunder Punch. So. Here we are. More than likely, this Charizard right here is going to be using Protect. So we're just going to have to, yeah, waste a Thunder Punch. And that didn't work, of course. And so let's go right ahead with a Thunder Punch. And Gravy! Yeah, it knew that we were coming. Good Gravy! Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, okay, so it was prepared. Okay, so... It knew... It knew that we were coming. It knew that we were coming. Okay, so... We are going to have to... Uh, we are going to have to uh, recover for this one right here. Let's see. Light screen and reflect. Nope. What is a good move that can actually help out my Charizard? Hmm. I could use Outrage, but that won't work. Hmm. Sludge Bomb, Fire Blast, Ice Punch would have worked. Rock Slide. Oh, here we go. Okay, so we can use Rock Slide right here. Now... We're kind of we're, we're we're just kind of scrambling the 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 moves right here just to see which one will work. This time I'm going to try and uh, this time I'm going to try not to do any mega evolution. Uh, it, it it would look like to me. Hold on, let me see what we got right here. Summary. All right, what do we got? What do we got? So our special attack is not that great, but our physical attack is good. This one is physical, so this would actually work. Yeah, but we need something like... We need something better, but... Fuck it, let's do it. Let's go ahead and try this one more time. And uh, hopefully we, we can win this one right now. 
So here we go, going up against Trainer Edmund, and yeah, he is prepared for anything right here. So let's see. What if we do? What if we use Toxic on this guy? I don't know. So protect. We got to get over this whole hump of protect right here. So, all right, Godzilla doesn't do anything. Of course, that Charizard is going to be faster. And, oh my god, that does better. Okay, okay, here we go. Let's do this. Come on, Charizard. And a Thunder Punch, it goes. And here we go, Rock Slide. <laughs> we win. Okay, sometimes it just takes for us to find the proper move, guys. So there it is. That is uh, the fourth trainer that we have defeated. Okay. So... Yeah. Okay, so that worked out perfectly. Okay, so that's four. Maybe, maybe, just maybe we can actually uh, achieve this goal right here of getting six tra six Pokemon. Uh, let's see. So, what do I have right now that can actually work for me? I know for a fact that if I use Alakazam, that's just gonna that's just gonna be effed up on me. Uh, best chance is for us to go to Blastoise, and this guy's gonna be at level eighty as well. Uh, let's see. Here's something that I, I failed to tell you guys, too. Uh, yeah, I've already tried Alakazam, and I've already tried Hydra, and uh, yeah, we got our butts kicked. Now, the only reason why I can't do, uh, I can't do Mew de Uno, especially with Mewtwo, is that we have to have a certain amount of CP on them. I believe for Mew de Uno, we we're supposed to have 8,000 CP, and Mewtwo, 9,000 CP. Uh, same goes for Meltran and uh, its evolutionary uh, form. So, well, let's see. We got four Pokemon down. I might as well just uh, might as well try Dragonite and Blastoise while we're at it. You know, since we're here. So, uh, let's see. Where is Dragon? Okay, so Blastoise is at level is at Route 20 at the Seafoam Islands. Dragonite. Dragonite will be located at the Cerulean City Inside House. Oh, geez. Okay, so this one is going to be a tough one right here. So, all right. <laughs> Maximum effort. Okay, so let's see. Let's go with Sparky right here. You're, you're, wait, remember something from Embarrassing from... Okay, never mind. Okay, so let's go right ahead and go to Cerulean City and hopefully win let's see that's Celadon and there we go again you can you can change up the moves every single time guys it's only gonna take one move to actually make this whole thing work so the house is probably gonna be right here it might be here or the other house is upstairs so let's see no that is a polyworld so that is a huge nope and let's see come on Probably one of these houses right here. Oh god. Let's see. Right here. Nope, that is not the person. And let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Polyrath is right behind. So it might be this house right here. And there he is. Okay, so here's something about this individual right now. Uh his Dragon Knight will indeed have Outrage, Ice Beam, Aqua Jet, and Reflect. So, I'm assuming that this guy's all physical forms and stuff. And he's, his Pokemon will be at level 75, I believe. Yes. So, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's check my summary here. And, uh... Okay, so I did add it, its new moves right here, just in case. Let's just go ahead and see if we can actually win this, okay? So, here we go. Dragonite Master, let's go ahead and see what we got going. Come on, baby. Come on. We should be fast. We should, we should be strong. We're taking on Ace Trainer Grayson right here. And, uh, well, here's his Dragonite. So hopefully my Dragonite can do, like, can pull it off. Come on, man. All right, let's see. Blizzard, come on. Don't fail me now. Good God. Okay, so it's a Reflect right there. Is... is Blizzard a, uh... God dang it. So, it's the same thing with, uh... Yeah, it's the same thing with what's-his-face, uh... 
Yeah, it's the same thing with uh, Sand Slash. I'm not going to win this one, but it looks like to me that we are going to win this uh, in the next in the next battle. So, all right, let's see how much uh, Blizzard can do if it even hits at all. So look at that, and it has Aqua Jet, so that's something to worry about. Okay, so we took our lickings right there. No thanks to uh, Blizzard. This is the reason why I don't like using these super powerful moves a lot, guys, because it, it just, when you need them the most, they just screw up on you. And as you can see, with the second person in a row, it, it just it failed on me miserably. Like, even then, if it, if, it, if it wouldn't have worked, then, you know, I would have been screwed either way. So here we go. Come on, Blizzard. Finish him. Oh, crap. All right, come on. Ah, oh, crap. So, yeah, we're not going to win this one. Good! Are you serious? Oh, my God. You cannot be serious. Oh, my God. So, we are faster. It's just... <laughs> wow. We can't... Wait. Oh, crud. Yeah. So let's see. We need a we need to add a little more special attack to this guy. We just need to add a little more. Okay, I don't want to talk to you right now. Let's go to the bag and see if we actually have uh, see if we actually have something right here. Let's see, smart candy. This one's for special attack. Let's just use them all on this guy. Yeah, just uh, as I thought, he he doesn't have the best special attack right now, so. Let's just use all the, the all these uh, special these smart candies right here, and let's see smart candy XLs. We got three of those. There we go. Come on, and give him a give him another one. And do we have a smart candy L? Nope. Okay. So and let's see. Hmm. Yep. It would seem that we don't have much right here. Yeah, that's why we have to capture and like you know send Pokemon to the uh, to Professor Oak because he does give us those candies and all that stuff. Wow, this game really makes you think, guys. It really does. Holy crud! Only will you ever see me lose a bunch of times in one episode right here. And well, let's hope that this will work right here. These extra boosts will give him uh, something. So come on, Blizzard, don't fail me now. Let's get it. Freeze him. Come on. And he's not frozen. Good gravy. And here comes its outrage attack. And wow. <laughs> okay, so that guy. Okay, so that right there. That might that might be the key. That might be the key right there since I am faster. Let's go ahead and see if we can actually get some outrage on this guy. So here we go going up against this guy, Grayson, you asshole you. Okay. Come on, baby. Let's do this. Uh, let's see. Outrage attack. Come on. And that took uh, the same amount. Good gravy. And of course... Oh, wow. He, he played me like a fiddle. Okay, so yeah. He played me like a fiddle right here. Yeah, okay, so he knew exactly what he was doing. We get confused, and here comes the Ice Beam. So now, it is a huge gamble for us right here. Come on, come on, come on, Dragonite! And yes! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, you suck! Oh my god. We almost got him, guys. We almost got him. Oh my god. I'm sorry for yelling, guys, but... Good gravy. This guy is really messing me up. Alright. Let's see. Tough candy. This one is defense, health candy, HP, uh, mighty candy. We got plenty of that. Okay, we got we gotta go a little higher than that. Let's see. Mighty candy, XL. Alright. Let's give him just a little bit more. Come on, Dragonite. Got to get him to 70. 270. Oh, my God. 
We almost had him, guys, but he played us like a god dang fiddle right there. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I fell for that trick. Okay, so... Uh, okay, let's go right ahead and battle this guy one more time. So here we go. Ace Trainer Grayson wants the battle. And... Well, he is coming out with his Dragonite, so... Let's see. Let's try a little strategy right here. I know I'm not going to win, but let's go with Toxic right here. See how that does. And the guy is poisoned, so he's badly poisoned. He is reflecting. Okay, so with that, he's losing HP every single time. So hopefully he gives us a little something. Now, we can't really freeze this guy, so we have to make it a good uh, one-shot KO right here. Come on, baby. God dang it! Balls! Yeah, so much for strategy, huh? <laughs> oh, jeez. Alright, I'm gonna battle you again. I'm gonna try and bat battle you one more time. And if I can't beat this guy, then you know what? Let's go to Blastoise. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. How in the hell can we beat these guys? I just want to know. And so, here we go. Battling up against Dragonite again. Screw it! Let's try and freeze him. Come on! Freeze him! Freeze! And is not frozen. Good gravy. Here comes his ice beam. And more than likely, he's going to freeze us because, yeah, fuck me. Good God! <laughs> oh, my Lord. Okay, so that is, what, five times that we have lost to this guy. This is ridiculous. Utterly ridiculous. I'm going for a freeze, guys. I'm sorry, but I am going for a freaking freeze right here. And if I can't beat this guy, then, you know, we're probably going to have to, like, train up just a little bit more. But from what it looks like, it doesn't matter how much level you got. You're still going to have to, like, very, like, grind it out and just beat this guy somehow. So here we go. Using a reflect. Okay, so here we go. Try this again. Come on, Blizzard. Freeze. Come on, freeze him. And not frozen because, yeah, screw me. Okay. I see what you just did right there. I see what you just did right there. Okay. Okay, so what is really getting at me is that reflect. So let's go right ahead and play. Let us play the same game right here. So Dragonite can learn reflect. Let's go right ahead and see what what it can do. So let's play him. Let's play him for move for move right here. Okay. So we can use reflect right here, and I think we do have ice beam around here somewhere. So let's see. Where are you, Dragon Pulse? Foul play. What? what how much? Uh, okay, eighty-five. Okay. Let's go for the more accurate move right here, and let's play him move for move. See if he uh, responds. So, let's go ahead and take away that blizzard attack. And, well, hopefully it will actually win. And you know what? Rock Slide is right here, too. It actually worked for us before, so... Let's see. Take away Thunderbolt, okay? Again, these are all moves that we can relearn from uh, all the TMs that we have. So, we're just trying to be specific or uh, strategic magic, guys. So, let's see. Let's go right ahead and battle him one more time. I keep on saying it's one more time, but not really. Not really. It's uh, it's not really one more time. So here we go again. Ace Trainer Grayson. So far, he is the true Dragonite Master. Not Lance. Not me. This guy. And look at that. Okay, so here we are. Two Dragonites in our prime. And let's go for a Rock Slide right here. And that doesn't do much. Holy crud. Okay, so... He's using Reflect. Okay. So he thinks I'm going to be using a physical move, but let's go right ahead and play a move for move right here. Since he, I know he's going to be using Outrage, and as you can see, we deflect that thing. Okay, so now, let's go right ahead and use Ice Beam. Hopefully we freeze this guy. Nope, not frozen. And here he comes with the froze uh, Ice Beam. And good, great. God dang it! <laughs> oh my god! What are the freaking odds? 
What are the odds that this guy is gonna freeze us? Oh my god. Ah, oh, you suck, Grayson. You suck. Oh my god, okay, so... Yep. Yep, just a freaking, uh... I'm just a loser right here, okay. Alrighty, let's go. Let's, uh, let's, let's go for this. Let us go for this right here, and, uh... Yeah, we're not gonna be lucky to, to freeze this guy, so we're just gonna keep on battling this guy until we can finally do it, so... Alright, level 80. Come on, Dragonite. Let's go with Ice Beam. Come on, freeze. Not frozen. Good gravy. And here comes a Reflect. Okay, so... Oh, God, okay. I'm going to try for Reflect right here. I know he's going to go for Outrage. After battling him quite a few times, then you're just going to, like, you're going to know what he does. Here comes his Outrage, and it doesn't take a lot. Now we're really going to have to play... We're going to have to play hard right here, so... Hopefully we can freeze this guy. I don't know. It's not going to freeze him. Look at that. Not frozen. And... Oh, it's frozen! Oh! <laughs> okay, let's go! Let's finish this guy off, and he's confused! Okay, here we go. Let's finish this guy off. Yeah, the shoe is on the other boot, or the, the, the boot isn't on the... Well, you know what I mean! Okay. Oh, I can do this. I can do this. Finish him. Yes. Gattaca! Eat it, Grayson! Oh, my God. It's about damn time. <laughs> so, look at that. That makes five friggin' trainers. And we are finally a Dragonite Master after losing, like, about eight times. <sighs> you see? Persistence, guys. Persistence. Okay. One more trainer to go, guys, and that is Blastoise. And we have to go straight to the Seafoam Islands right here. And, of course, Pikachu's not going to be very happy with this. He's like, okay, making anxious. Let's go right ahead and uh, let's go straight to Fuchsia City. Holy crap, it was about goddamn time that we actually froze this guy. You see, we battled him move for move and we got him. Oh my god, okay, so this this thing right here is making me learn how to battle competitively now, so that's good, that's great. Okay, and uh, well, now it is time for us to go straight to uh, the trainer with the Blastoise. Now, this Blastoise right here has Taunt, whoop, right there, Taunt, and a few other moves that, you know, I failed to realize. This guy's going to be very, very tough, not at level, well, it's at level 80. So my plan right here is to teach my Blastoise Toxic, that way I can uh, finish this guy off. On top of that, uh, use its Mega Evolutionary Stone, just so I can not get beat right here. So, where would this guy be? There's Tentacool. And... Don't tell me he's on the other side. Good God. Yeah, he's on the other side. Okay, so, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's go right here to see Cinnabar. And let me check my um. Let me check my uh, iPad again to see if I can actually find this guy. Let's see. So the last trainer that we have to beat is Blastoise, and this is all through the experience of like you know all the battles that I've had before. Route 20 east of Seafoam Islands. Northeast, good gravy. Huh? I went far off, okay. So, this this Blastoise right here has Substitute, Fake Out, Rock Slide, and Dark Pulse. So, using Toxic would probably uh, be a better uh, tactic right, th right here. So, whew, okay. Uh, just one more trainer, guys. One more trainer, and we unlock something pretty big right here, which I will actually feature within the next few episodes. Um, this is the reason why I trained my Pokemon up to level 80 because, yeah, this is, the, this is the stuff that we've been waiting for right here. So, we're going east. We're gonna go locate this guy. We're at Route 19. And, okay, so Pikachu, let's do your thing again. Oh man, this 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 has been this right here has been a fun experience. I I mean I don't like losing. I really don't like losing, guys. 
but this game has, is really teaching me how to actually get my, or just, you know, fix up my Pokemon a little bit better. Like I said, I'm not too big on the whole uh, researching the whole, uh, what kind of combinations, items, and all that stuff will work properly on our Pokemon and all that crud. But this game right here is actually teaching me well. So here's Blastoise. And, well, let's see. We really have to work hard with this guy right here. So, all right. We're, uh, we're definitely not going to be using a lot of water type moves. So take away Ice Beam right here. We have Earthquake. And we gotta pay, we gotta give him a let's see facade could be learned R Ras protect let's see drill run surf fire punch toxic okay so let's go with the toxic right here this one will actually work for us so we'll take away brick break and. Okay, so that is that, and uh, let's see, self-destruct, yeah, self-destruct will not work. Flash cannon, what is this one? User gather all the light and release uh, at once, it may lower special defense, that's not going to work. Call mine, not going to work. Foul play, taunt right here, what does this do? Taunted rage allows only one move per turn, okay, so that right there is the reason why we're using toxic, and then... Uh, Okay, so we gotta use a move that will actually help us. Outrage. Okay, outrage could work. Okay, so let's go with with let's go with the moves that we have right now, and from there we're just gonna, you know, we're just gonna wing it. So let's move this guy. Come on, Leonardo. I know you are female and all that stuff. Uh, <laughs> I know you're a female, and I know that you're named uh, after a guy, but I need you now, right here. Okay, so, again guys, this is what persistence gives you, it actually works out for the best right here, so, um, right here, go ahead and talk, and I'm a Blastoise Master, the ultimate goal, yada yada yada, let's get this. Alrighty, so here we go, Pro quite possibly the last one that we'll battle in uh, quite some time, but here is Blastoise against Blastoise. And if I'm not mistaken, she doesn't have a Mega Stone, so we'll be good. It's just we got to be very strategic about this. So let's go with a Toxic right here. And of course, you're going to be using Fake Out. Completely forgot. So let's go again. Toxic. And it does have Rock Slide. So what this Pokemon is trying to do is make us flinch. So our goal right here is to make it, make it go down. Toxic and everything. So now... Yes, you're hurt by poison, and now let's go right ahead and use Seismic Toss because I believe it's the level of the Pokemon that we're going up against that equals the amount of damage it will get. So, nice 80 points taken, and here comes its substitute, so there we go, it's killing itself within. So there we go, Seismic Toss, look at that, and it the Toxic is just killing them. Alright. Let's try this again. Let's go with Earthquake this time. And here comes a Rock Slide. Will it work? No, not that not that much. And there it goes with its substitute. And like I said, guys, Toxic is killing it within, within its whole substitute and all that crud. And the substitute has faded. But it is still taking damage from Toxic right here. So little by little, we're beating this guy. So let's go with a Seismic Toss. And, oh god, he's going for another Rock Slide right here. Here we go. So, I guess we're going to win this one right here. Look at that. And the next one kills it. <laughs> yes! Woo! That is how you do it, guys. You see? I'm strategic, too. It's just, uh... Took me a while before the, you know, the, the, the gears really grinded. So, there it is, guys. Six... Pokemon in all. Now, what does that do? I'll tell you what that does. And, okay, so Pikachu, you're just giving me a, just a furrowing brow. So, 
what that does is this. We're going to go straight to the Pokemon League. We're not going to do anything. We're just going to show you guys what it does. So after defeating six Pokemon Masters, Pokemon Trainer Masters, this unlocks the one and only Red right there. So within the next few episodes, I'm going to be battling different trainers. I believe I'm probably going to go... I'm probably going to save this battle second to last. But we still got another trainer to battle because there's been this hoopla about this green trainer we need to go to. So we'll get to her first. In the meantime, as you can see, there's Red. He's waiting for us. We will battle him eventually. His Pokemon team is going to be a tough one. And uh, I believe we're going to finish it off with the Pokemon League as well. So thank you guys for watching. Excuse me for all the yelling and all that crap. But it's finally done. We did it in one episode. So thank you guys for watching. Let's go ahead and... Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh, he gave us something. And what does he give us? A shirt? Oh, heart shape. Okay. Never mind. Okay, so you deserve yourself this. There we go. And there we go. Good job. Okay, good boy. Okay, so with that being said, guys, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode as we go back to the Cerulean Cave to go check out this green character. See you guys.